Hi there. My name is Emma. In this video, I'll explain why researchers perform vulnerability research and exploitation. A vulnerability researcher is a cybersecurity professional who specializes in identifying and analyzing security weaknesses in software systems. This can include analyzing the code, architecture, and configuration of software systems to identify potential vulnerabilities. They also use their knowledge of common attack methods and exploit techniques to understand how vulnerabilities can be exploited in the real world. A vulnerability researcher may work for a security consulting firm, a software vendor, a government agency, or a large corporation. By performing vulnerability research, researchers are able to proactively identify and address vulnerabilities, rather than waiting for attackers to discover and exploit them. This can help organizations and software vendors to be proactive in their security measures, rather than reactive. Furthermore, performing vulnerability research and reporting it responsibly before bad actors can lead to a win-win situation for both the researcher and the software vendors. Researchers can be rewarded for their findings and the vendors can learn from their mistakes and improve their security measures. Organizations need to prioritize which vulnerabilities to address first. For example, a vulnerability that allows an attacker to take complete control of a system may be considered a higher priority than a vulnerability that only allows an attacker to read data. Furthermore, it can also help organizations evaluate the effectiveness of their existing security measures. Organizations may also need to communicate the risks to stakeholders. For example, if a vulnerability has a high potential impact, an organization may choose to communicate the risks to its customers and partners and provide guidance on how to mitigate the risk of attacks. First of all, to effectively develop security mitigations, it is important to have a thorough understanding of the underlying security threats and vulnerabilities. Once security mitigations have been developed, they must be thoroughly tested to ensure they work as intended and do not introduce new vulnerabilities. This may involve reverse engineering and analyzing the new mitigations for weaknesses and limitations. It could also involve testing the mitigations on older vulnerabilities to validate their effectiveness. When a mitigation is bypassed, researchers will look for ways to improve it, and the virtuous circle begins again. Researchers can provide recommendations to developers on how to improve the security of their software. This could include recommendations on how to prevent similar vulnerabilities from being introduced in the future. By reporting vulnerabilities, researchers can raise awareness of security issues in the development process. This helps to encourage software vendors and developers to take security more seriously and to adopt best practices to improve security in their development process. By working together, researchers and vendors can build a collaborative relationship that benefits everyone. Collaboration can lead to a better understanding of vulnerabilities. If you liked this video, please hit like and share this video on social media. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive more videos like this one. Join our online community of students learning useful cybersecurity skills if you haven't already. To register for a free account right away, go to our website. Happy learning and see you soon!